So what do we got? Let me go over here. We got five to the power of two over three. The way it works is that three in the denominator moves to the to the radical in front of the five, okay? It'll be like two more minutes. Okay, awesome. <laughs> so the way it works is we got a skater over there. He wants to skate. Uh, he's uh, being nice, taking a break. Uh, so what we got is uh, five to the power of two over three. And what it does is it grabs the three in the denominator and moves it to the front of the five. And it becomes the radical, okay, the root symbol. So that's the way rational numbers work. So basically with the natural numbers, if you put anything from the natural number set in the exponent, it clones itself. The number of times it says you should clone it. If you put anything from the whole number set, it clones it if it's one of the natural numbers, which is two, one, two, three, all the way to infinity. And if you include the zero, if you put a zero up top, it makes whatever is here, the whole thing equal to one. If you go to the integers, with the integers it flips it. With the rational numbers, it puts it in the radical and it basically becomes the root of. Now I'm gonna do a lot of examples with this stuff and hopefully you can see it. I'm gonna start off slow and break it all down. With the irrational numbers, you just put the irrational number there. If it's negative, then it flips it if it's an irrational number. The irrational numbers are, you know, they're, uh, they're, they're a special case. So we're gonna deal with those later. They basically include everything here. You just can't do it as nicely, break it down and stuff. Um, well, you can't need a calculator to do it, or you've got to be really good at uh, doing it by hand, okay? So this is basically our real number set applying to anything in the exponent, and exponents are basically radicals, okay? So exponents are radicals, they come from the rational number set, okay? We're going to do a lot of problems with these things. Uh, because I know it sort of becomes complicated and you've got to be really good at simple algebra, which is just basically addition multiplication uh, with fractions and just break it all down because it's, um, again, like I said before, you have to be able to massage numbers, break them down and really understand the real number set because this whole thing, this real number set is the majority of the numbers, actually it should be almost all the numbers you deal with in high school, except if they introduce uh, imaginary numbers, the square root of a negative one, uh, of negative numbers basically. So the real number set is, it's crucial for you to understand this because it applies everywhere. One of the first places it applies, it breaks it down into its different sections in the exponents, which is again a huge part of high school mathematics where you have to learn how to break numbers down. And all of this, this whole thing is really dependent on, not dependent on, but it's really important for you to know the prime numbers because you use prime numbers, you, you break things down basically um, based on their prime factors, especially in the rational numbers in the exponent, which becomes radicals, the, the root of, the cube root of, square root of, the fifth root of, whatever root of, whatever number is in the denominator, or, over here. Whatever's the number in the denominator it goes to the radical. So whatever you put there, that's the root you want. So all of that is dependent on you being able to break things down into the prime trees, prime factors. Okay. Super important. I'm gonna do a lot of examples with this. Hopefully this made sense. I had to do this real quick. I've come here like four times and it's always been busy, so we had to get it done. We had a little lull period there, okay? So uh, go through this and um, we're gonna have a lot of a uh, lot of examples coming up with the video. Uh, um, exponents. Okay. Yeah. So basically, it's broken down into natural numbers, whole numbers, integers, and rational. And each one does a special thing. It says the diagonal one, two, three clones itself and repeats itself. Yeah. Does it say? Yeah. So it does. Do you want me to show you? Yeah. Yeah.
Yo, that's my time. Yo, that's my time. I know all you fellas have had a lady in your life that you really appreciated. And you wanted to do something special for her and let her know it. Well, I got a lady like that. And I wrote this song for her. And I saw you at the bar or something I ain't really wanna holler or nothing I just pegged you as the type for fronting Steady talking with your girlfriends Acting contrary and clucking But your song came on And something changed in the way She was moving them long Eyelashes caught flashes of the possibilities Maybe this one is the one for me She's moving to the dance floor We'll see What I seen was inspirational Highly motivational Had to maneuver to set up the confrontationals Even though it was my chance to mac I'd already did my dance Had the reservoir tap Hit me like a thunderclap No, can't let something that fat pass by, why ask why, made my way through the crowd with the side to side.